you miss your idle days? I kind of saw it as my last two years of high school because I, I actually got my GED after sophomore year to do American Idol. You get in this group and you're with them for a year, it just becomes like your class. And it's... what about when they were so mean to you? Like you probably got the worst reviews of anybody <laughs> on Idol, but they were so mean every week and it didn't matter. For one, they definitely are looking for that shock value. They want to say the thing that'll make you cry or whatever, try to get that reaction from you. But for me, it was more about what in what they're saying will help me to get better. And then talking of crying, last night J-Lo cried, like mm -hmm. the, the roles were reversed, what do you yeah. think? That was, I mean, I can't imagine how hard it must be, especially now that it's getting closer and closer, you invest yourself in these people as a judge, you see them and you're paying attention to their story and how they're progressing each week and I mean, I'm sure it's really hard to cut someone that you liked, especially someone with a story like that. And do you think um, we like Jennifer Lopez better now that she cried? Um, I think that it shows a really honest uh, perspective of her. I, she was one of the mentors on my season. She was? Yeah. What was that like? She was such a sweetheart. No. She, she wanted to sit really? down on the floor and like she walked in and she's like, let's cop a spot on the floor. And they're like, no, you have to sit on the bench. She's like. Okay, I feel like story time. It was so cool. So when you did it, it was Paula and Simon. Did you get close to them? Uh, yeah, well, especially Paula would come back and actually give us little pep talks after the show. Was or she a little crazy? Like a, she was a sweetheart. She was so sweet. Like, people give her a lot of nonsense. How did these judges compare? It's a great new perspective because before it was like the performer, the producer, and the executive. And now it's more like performer heavy, it's more that artist's perspective. I mean, if I had gone in and auditioned for Steven Tyler and Jennifer Lopez, I probably would have freaked out. I can't imagine how these 15-year-old kids are doing it.